Hi everyone, John Paul here from InMotion Hosting and welcome back to our advanced support series. Today we're going to show you how to log into your server with SSH. Alright, we're going to begin by logging into your cPanel. As you see, I've just logged in. And then scroll down to the security section and we're going to click this SSH slash shell access button. That's going to bring you to this SSH page. Click Manage SSH Keys, and then we want to click Generate a New Key. This is important that you use a very strong password here. Once you've entered your password, click Generate Key here on the bottom, and you'll see Key Generation Complete Message. Go ahead and click Back again. Before we can download the private key, we first have to manage authorization and authorize the key. Now we're going to go to private keys and we're going to view and download that key. Click download key and you'll see it downloads to my computer. At this point we're going to open putty gen and we're going to click load. Down here in the bottom right changes to all files and then select the file you just downloaded. It's going to ask for the password, enter the password that you created for it. And then click load and you'll see this message here, successfully imported foreign key. Click OK and then save that, that key. I'm going to save it as private key file. All right, and then that's it with Putty Gen. You can do away with that. And then let's bring Putty over now. And the first thing we want to do is on the left here, click connection, and then under connection, click the plus next to SSH, and then click auth. We're, right now we're going to browse, and we're going to find that private file, and then click open. All right, that's good. Now back up to session, enter your host name here, and for port, put 2222, okay? and then click open. And you'll see this message is security alert. Go ahead and say yes. And then you'll see this message come up here. It's gonna ask for you to log into Putty. Enter your cPanel username here. and then enter the passphrase for your key file. And you'll see once you do that, it's going to log you in and you'll see it come up just like that. And that means you've successfully connected to your server via SSH. Thanks for joining us for another video in our advanced support series. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel below and also leave questions in the comments section so we can bring you more great videos. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? There's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.